Turkey is famous for its Camel Running Festival that attracts thousands of people from all across the globe every year. But this international Camel Running Festival is now facing criticism. Animal rights groups are of the opinion that the camels are abused and injured during the event. More in this next report. The 40th International Camel Running Festival was held on the 16th of January in the western Turkish town of Selçuk. A total of 152 camels dressed in ornamental clothing and embroidery of various patterns and colors on their humps and necks participated in this festival. The event is expected to run till the end of March where only one camel is chosen as the winner in a victorious celebration. Visuals on your screen show camels being brought into a sandy arena with referees and other personnel assisting them. These camels are further made to wear muzzles in order to prevent bite wounds. It is impossible for the camels to bite and harm each other. Furthermore, there are 22 people in the wrestling area, 11 for each camel, who are called rope holders and tasked with separating the camels. These people pull the camels away from each other immediately when the referee feels a negativity. There is certainly nothing such as breaking each other's feet or biting each other. The festival, which is famous all over the country, attracts scores of tourists. Thousands of people set up tables and chairs while they watch these animals fight. However, the animal rights activists have now sounded an alarm. They are slamming the Turkish Camel Wrestling Festival for all the right reasons. Animal fight is a big crime. How can this happen? You see an animal alive being fight in front of you and it is suffering, is wounded and maybe they kill each other. People enjoy this and maybe make a financial profit. But Turks say that the wrestling between animals is done with an emotion of love, keeping in mind all adequate measures that are taken to avoid any kind of mishap. It is something that is done with love. It's not a fight. It is wrestling, just like how humans wrestle. Their mouths are muzzled. They cannot bite each other. All kind of measures are taken and this culture emerged many years ago. But the question which arises is, a tradition which is 2,400 years old and is connected to the Turks, can that be banned in the near future or not? Bureau Report, we on World is One. We on is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.